What is going on guys? Today we have got the man that is Sala. You're tired of you're tired of coming up against teams that want to rip your hair out every single day, make sure you check u7buy.com for the most reliable and cheapest coins on the market. And at checkout, make sure you hit that JT11 for 5% off your order, and hopefully you have a good day. He took so much of the club. Honestly, if you've done him, you know how much this card could took, but 99 rated cam, it had to be done. Look at the card. 18 SBCs, multiple 90s. What a fantastic card to get in the game. A 5-star, five 5-star five Sala. We've got stats that just are criminal. Absolutely criminal. But I thought, you know what? We're, we're getting towards the end now. We've got to send it. We've got to absolutely send it. The price, I don't think we've got. We may get by the end of the game uh, or by the end of the review. So hopefully we'll see that. But the card is phenomenal. Left-footed, 5-5 five, five in that cam. He is going to be tried as a striker because why? Well, I, I wouldn't not do this card and not put him as a striker. He's got, an, what is it, architect is what people are saying. So it'd give you 98, pa uh, 98 pass, 95 physical. That is just absolutely absurd. To finish off, especially if you are a Liverpool fan, this card is a must. An absolute must. He is in, looking incredible. We've got the flare pass, the new pass uh, trait on him. We've got outside of the foot, flare, finesse. It's, it's absolutely perfect. A perfect striker in the game. I think he's 90, was it his 97 team of the season. I'm yet to actually get, but it's, he looks phenomenal as it is. This is going to be beautiful. Up and down a pitch. We've got Virgil in the defense, so we can link him there if needed. The stats itself, there, there's very little to criticize there. All of them are above 98 at the very minimum. The, the acceleration and sprint speed is practically maxed. The finishing is maxed. Passing-wise, again, short is great. Curve, crossing, vision. Even the long passing is still at 92. That's definitely nothing to grumble at. We've got dribbling that is one stat bar from perfect. That is crazy. Stamina, very nice. With, obviously, the architect. We'll go grab it on now. And there we go. Beautiful. So we have got, obviously, the 98 passing. We see that pretty much maxes out most stuff. Uh, you get 90 free kick accuracy. The short pass goes to max. 97 long and 99 vision. Then we get 99 strength with that plus 11. 92 jump in and 82 aggression. I feel like the only way to, to kind of give this card its recognition, let's jump straight into some games with him. I'd say literally the only problem you're going to have with getting this Sala is just actually getting him into the team with the amount of uh, footies cards we've actually had. There's no real, it's mainly French if anything, so you're going to have an abundance of French players and trying to fit an Egyptian Prem player in. You've obviously got Varane as, as the big one there, but... It will be that point to try and change a team around for him. So I'm interested to see. Lovely little spin from Neymar. He, again, is just next level. We find a bit of a Sala here. Varane doing his job. Sala, here we go. Let's find something. He's got... Should have absolutely oodles of pace as we find the outside. And Cancelo just taps the ball away. Little dink over the top. Sala, back heel was inevitable there if we could have just got that touch quicker. The acceleration on him is absolutely splendid as we try and find some openings. Obviously, defenders now, they are going to be quite quick as well. Well, this guy's got the elite of defenders as well. Varane 99, the whole, the whole shebang. But it is going to be interesting to see, does he have still that good option in terms of being the 99 stat everywhere? Is he better than, obviously, his counterpart in the 97, um, Salah? Obviously, then you've got Dembele, you've got Neymar, Ben Yedda. There's a, a lot of options, and that's where it becomes interesting to see, is he really worth all them SBCs? Just gets the block again. Salah again. Good hit this time. Manages to find through the defender, but keeper's always on his game as well. Sala from distance. Oh, he hits the post. So, so close. Dribbling for Sala is just absolutely nuts. Like you can imagine. The one thing I would compare him to is I actually feel like his dribbling is better than Dembele. Neymar is, is, a, is a funny one because I do rate uh, Neymar very highly on his dribbling. But if you've got a lot of the options and maybe you've not necessarily finished any of them yet... I would personally say Neymar's dribbling's the better one, personally, how I've used him. Dembele would be third, and Salah's intricate dribbling as well would, would definitely put him in that second spot for me. As we find that left foot to find the near post, we know that the best thing with these 99 and 98 cards is sometimes you kind of, you don't even need to necessarily be 
incredible at the game. They just tend to win the ball a lot more. I don't know what it is. Oh, that is it. Oh, he's offside. First goal disallowed. Forty absolutely had that. Find Salah from distance here. Goes for the finesse and De Gea with the punch away again. Oh, that is beautiful. Salah cutting it across. And again, the the AI defending on this these past couple of games has been absolutely nuts for them. Salah goes in. Again, Ruben, just, uh, he needs to go away. Speed on this card. Beautiful stuff from him. Can we find a little bit of a whip into him? Right-footed whip. Neymar finds the head, but unfortunately does go far of the post. I think Zanetti's got a clip on it. Into Salah's feet. He's going to fake the round. Gets the second, and you know he's going to score from there. There's no way that he doesn't. Beautiful opening goal for him. Takes us back equal, and can we find the second now he's opened up the scoreline for me? Find him on the inside. It's beautiful. The pace is there. The second, and he's hit the post again. Unbelievable stuff. Founds it. Oh, it's beautiful from Salah. Right foot again. Don't need his left. We've got the 5-5. And he's put us one up. Oh, it's beautiful. Sees him across. Ruben with the left foot. And Neymar now going to pick up the pieces. Gets the right foot also. And Neymar gets the third one to take us into the lead even more. So then, let's have a look at Salah. Have we got a price? Not yet. Okay. So we've got 18 squads. I can imagine he's probably still coming in relatively cheap in comparison to what all of these squads look like. We have two 92s, four 91s, four 90s. Then also, if I can flip everything, we also have an 89, an 88, an 87, needing a Liverpool, um, a Premier League and an inform or team of the season standard. And then obviously you need two foot birthdays, two fantasy, three uh, captains, six team of the seasons and five shapeshifters. Unfortunately, the shapeshifters cannot be heroes. I don't see why they can't, but unfortunately, I believe they have to be the specific card type. Obviously, with for birthday, Cruz is a big one. Sancho's there and also... There was another one that, uh, Kamen Vinger. No, that was fa uh, that was fantasy. There was somebody else in Foot Birthday that when I had to buy one was there as well. Own Guard, of course. Fantasy, you're looking at Kamen Vinger. You're looking at Gelson Martins. And um, I think Dembele might be in rotation. Still the same with St. Max. And then Captains and everything else is a standard. But the SBCs, there's just a lot of them. You do get a good amount of packs back, which is always good. I don't know if I can actually... Oh, I can show you that. Um, so again, it uh, doesn't actually show me the names. I need to... Oh, I need to flip them this way, in fact. There we go. Yeah, so you get the rare player uh, twice. You get megas. Uh, quite a few of them, to be fair. Prime golds. So you get a good amount of packs. And to be fair, we managed to get a Vinny tradable 150k back into the bank. So you do get a hit and miss. The card is just grindable. That is really the, the best thing for him. He is out until the 14th of September. So you've got a, a few weeks to get him done, which is always nice. And we've had the loading screen for preseason, which looks like we're going to continue with all of these specials impacts by the looks of it so far, as well as SBCs being re-released as a uh, kind of cheaper price hopefully but in terms of Salah he's phenomenal he's brilliant his pace is absolutely unreal dribbling is fantastic shooting's nice the card is just naturally an end game completed card and I would say if you are going to complete anywhere uh, anybody Neymar would be my number one I would probably say Salah is next. Dembele is cracking, but I do think Salah is better. As well as St. Max is definitely up there. Griezmann's very nice. Ver uh, Varane has got to be in there for the defensive option as well. He's probably the most uh, or the best defender you're going to get in this game now until the very end. Unless we got somebody transferred that was 99 rated as well. But Varane at the moment is probably the best centre-back you can get on the game in terms of an SBC as well. But Salah is a cam. You can put him up and down a pitch. Everybody has a verge somewhere you've got Cancelo chi uh, chi uh, chilling around with obviously the Prem links you then look at uh, Mane as a left wing you then obviously got a Firmino if you really wanted to um, Liverpool have some amazing specials as well so you do hopefully well maybe we might get a Nunes transferred 
That'd be an interesting one. Diaz, again, is another brilliant option there, as well as Allison Trent, all of them good cards also. So there's no shy of links at the moment. You're definitely going to be able to get them into the team, whether you'd be able to get them in without changing some absolute massive positions because we've had so many footies. But this card is always going to be a 10 out of 10. So let me know down below if you are completing him. Make sure you do like and subscribe on this because the club is absolutely mudded. But apart from that, make sure you do like and subscribe. I catch you all for the next one. Peace.